some in me tells me to believe in this nigga. Well, you know what? If this man loses, my dick is small. What's up, YouTube? Welcome to another video with your boy K Money. Um, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. Rachel in position. We're just waiting for Angel to get here with her boyfriend. It's getting hot up in here. They need to hurry up. What the hell? Hey girl, what's up? Where are you? Literally had to park like all the way down. Did you like park um around the corner? Oh my gosh, I think it's you. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, there you are. <laughs> okay. Alright, see you soon. Alrighty guys, alrighty guys, here we go. This is it. Angel has arrived. I repeat. Man, Angel Sergio just look like a fucking punchable ass looking? nigga. How are we I don't know. Looking? We're looking good? Sergio, if you're watching this, don't put me on one of your episodes. Rogue 24 is rolling. Over. Perfect, perfect. Remember, let's get good shots, but do not get caught. I repeat, don't get caught. Over. Damn, and no intro? I know. Today, we put together and executed yet another loyalty test. This time, our friend Rachel would be asking Angel's boyfriend on a date. We'll just call him Jay. So normally, like, I'll do a couple Do a loyalty test on my girlfriend? I just want to do one, two. Nah, like, you nah. just tell me when you're you ready to talk, talk to and then we'll just go back. So Rachel's going to be asking Jay on a date at our apartment. So in order for that to happen, you, to set me you up? just got to get with Melly? And luckily, we have the perfect plan. We learned that Jay was into health and fitness through Angel. Because of this, we instructed her to bring him to this trail. Angel managed to do so by convincing him to go on a morning run right, with definitely. her and her supposedly good friend, Rachel. It actually is a really nice date. I know it's like it's like I feel like it's, it's like a little bit chilly, but like for the run, it's gonna be perfect, you know. Hey, How creepy does this look, guys? Are we like creeps for like setting this up and doing this? <laughs> it's okay, guys. You guys are just taking pictures of her. <laughs> bro, get, bro, bro. We'll just start right here. So lame, you bro. Jump onto the path. Yeah. Okay, ready? Okay. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. Runners are off. I repeat, runners are off. <laughs> On the surface, this may seem like just another run, but what Jay doesn't know is that this is only the first phase <laughs> of his loyalty test. It's time to move on to phase number two. Anthony, you are coming with me. Ken, you're just gonna kick back and just keep us updated. Gotcha. <laughs> Melly, are you gonna do this on me? Cause I never fall. <laughs> I ain't never so like I said, This run was only the first phase of our loyalty test. We still had three Slap, more phases to go. go. The purpose of phase two was for Rachel to simply meet Jay. They've done so, and they are currently on their run. Right now, we're on our way to Whole Foods so that we can get Anthony into position for phase number two. So after their run, the plan was for the trio to enjoy some smoothies together. I think I told Angel already. I'm not sure if she told you, but I want to bring you guys back for smoothies at my place afterwards. Oh, sure, I totally forgot. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now the trio would be grabbing the ingredients to make these smoothies at a nearby Whole Foods, which is only a short drive away from the trail. <laughs> is it absolutely mandatory that I have to creep around? I mean, you don't have to creep around. You just have to basically pretend like you're trying to creep creepy, yeah. Hey, man, where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Anthony would be keeping tabs on the trio while they were at Whole Foods shopping for the smoothie ingredients. So we are leaving Anthony behind at the Whole Foods and we are making our way to the apartment. Remember, My bitch walk around naked like she hates me. The trio will be making the smoothies and where Rachel will be making her move. Bro, hurry up, start this test. Hey, what's up? I just want to call you. No, it looks like they're getting ready to go. Wait, are you serious? Like they're done, done, done. They're done running? Yeah, they're, they're on the way back towards me right now. Dude, it's only been like 25 or 30 minutes. They didn't want to run three miles, so yeah, so they're, they're done for sure. Okay, copy that. We'll just get out of there and just meet us back here. Time was of the essence, which meant that we had to hurry setting up our hidden cameras and establishing our live feed. You look stressed. I look stressed? Yeah. It's been a long day. I bet it has. <laughs> I, I wish y'all could see what goes on before sometimes, because this mother be going around. Man, this honey's ass nigga, bro. I can't stand this nigga, bro. <laughs> Look, he look like he's sucking dick already, bro. So if my calculations are correct, Anthony should be stalking the trio at the Whole Foods right now, which means that I'm gonna use this time to thank our friends at Hive.com for sponsoring this video. Hey, hey, don't buy it, don't buy it. They didn't sponsor me. You want it? Okay. This is my tea. You know what? I, I, I hope so. I wanna get something for Angel, just in case, hopefully not, but just in case this test goes south, we can get her something nice, right? To hopefully make her feel better. Let's look up some boxes for Angel. Ooh, we got a Dior. You stole that one! Yeah, I'm sorry. for gifting off your first any moment now. I don't know about you guys. Back to this test because the trio might be out of that Whole Foods any moment now. I don't know about you guys, but I'm ready to make these smoothies. Can if your girl right. get a hundred pounds during your relationship, would you still be loyal? Okay. Yes, I'd still be loyal, but she's not getting a hundred pounds when she's with me. 
Chat, me as a person, I'm not one of these goofy ass niggas that be lying to the girls and shit, right? If I would find a really nice way to tell my lady, yo, you you getting a little weight on you and it's not on your booty. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Come to the gym with me, tag along. I'm a very convincing nigga. That doesn't work, I'm gonna give a good dick and I'm gonna tell her you can't get it tonight if you don't go to the gym with me. She gonna put in work, get some dick. And I'm gonna make her lose that weight. See, me, as, as I'm a loyal man, you see, we'll get through it together. This is them, guys. This is them. They are entering the apartment here. And with that, phase number two was officially complete. How was the stocking, sir? It was amazing. <laughs> oh, God. I'm pretty sure. I'm well, pretty I sure can't I can stand make a people that... if I wanted to. <laughs> It was now time to move on to phase number three, which <laughs> was not a the trio making those smoothies. They got some spinach. You never had a smoothie with spinach? A smoothie with spinach? Bro, that does not sound good. It's a bomb, and you don't even taste it. Oh no, the only smoothies I've ever had are strawberry, strawberry bananas. bananas. <laughs> basic. <laughs> basic. Just basic. Uh uh. The purpose of this third phase was for Rachel Wait, to banana, make banana, and uh, and uh, what's it called? Strawberry is basic? What's going on? I drink banana and strawberry. That's my favorite. I'm not no basic ass nigga, but what if she fully disagrees with you? Like I'm take uh, I'm taking this as uh, advice. Your girl gained a hundred pounds. Where were you at? <laughs> Bro, okay, you you seen her? Okay, she gained ten pounds. Oh my god, baby, you're eating good. I love it for you. Twenty. Okay, baby, you're eating good. It's so nice. Thirty. Oh, baby. <laughs> <laughs> you know, throwing a joke in there. Who giving you all this food? What's going on? 50. Baby, baby, baby. 50 pounds? Where were you at the whole time? The whole time she gained 100 pounds, where were you at? The whole time. It's your fault. Suck it up now. Dive in that belly. <laughs> Eat it up. It's your fault, suck it up. Bond even more, so we had Rachel ask him for help in making the smoothies. At the same time, we also had to get Angel out of there. Therefore, when the time was right, she would be making up an excuse to exit the scene. Do you have a big give up though? Uh, no. Oh my gosh. Oh, I think this is it, guys. I think Angel's making up her excuse to leave. Did you check your pocket? I didn't even bring a bag. That's my phone. I left it in the car. Did you really left it? No, because I had it I in saw it. Foods. Yeah, I saw no, it. No, 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 no. I did. I used it. You used it at home? Okay, let me yeah, give it a I call should. real quick. I'm going to text my mom. So did you find my iPhone? I should go back and look. Oh, she's playing it off so good. <laughs> Man, he about to get successfully tissue. makes her exit by pretending to go look for her phone back at the Whole Foods. Oh, I feel so bad. I told her she should do fine my iPhone. In reality, Angel simply makes her way over to our command center and prepares to watch and listen in to the last and final phase of this test. I think we're making a smoothie. Chris, you already All know. Right. Okay, so on a scale of one to ten, like how confident are you that he's going to pass? I mean, we're here. Like, I, I brought you all here. So, right. I mean, I'm five, a six being so hopeful. So, 50, 50, I mean, 50 still? I, mean, I that's, don't know. Damn, she know her looking not loyal. Right oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> she said if he fails, <laughs> it's <laughs> my fault. <laughs> I obviously don't know what I'm doing whatsoever. I thought I was too. So in case you guys are wondering, Angel wanted to place her boyfriend to the test because yeah. she's actually been through something like this before. Aww. Yes, I had an ex uh, cheat on me with one of my best friends. That is crazy. How long ago was this? Gosh, like two years ago? Two years ago. Okay, 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 chat. Your girl cheats on you with your best friend. Right? Whose? Whose fault is that? Who are you? Who'd you be mad more? Your girl or your or your man's? Let me let me let me answer the question. Let me answer the question. Let me answer the question. I just, my mindset right now, it's like, like, she cheats on me, bro, like, damn, I, like, you know what I'm saying, like, I was treating her good, she, you know, and, fuck it, but my man's though, nigga, my man's though, nigga, my man stuck it in, I don't hit women, but I hit niggas, 
So I think I'll definitely beat a nigga ass. But a good point you can bring up, as in you'd be more mad at your girl, is it takes a lot for a girl to open up her legs. Not it doesn't take a lot for a guy to put down his pants, right? You can you can like you can make an excuse for the guy talking about he's so horny, bro. Like and she seduced him and shit like that. You can make an excuse for that, but girls. She did it on purpose. She did it on purpose. It's a lot easier for a girl, any girl, to seduce a guy than it is for any guy to seduce a girl. And that's a factual statement. So the girl, 90, 90% chance that the girl initiated it. So I think I'd be more mad at my girl. But what am I, what am I going to do if I'm mad at the girl? You know what I'm saying? Probably cheat on her back. I don't know. I, just, I ain't never been through that. I ain't never been through that. I don't know. So still, I would say it's still fairly fresh, oh, right? Yeah, like, yeah. like how did that happen? Like how? I think it started off in the same scenario. Like you, you start to hang out, and you think that like, oh, we're we're all good. Like we can all hang out and be acquainted together. But I mean, you never know what's happening behind the scenes, right? Yeah. Like, yeah, of course it didn't work out well for me. I tried not to cry in that scenario, yeah. but then, you mean the second you walk out the door, I mean. And they're still together, in case you're wondering. They're still together? Yeah. Shit. Oh, Lord Jesus. Yeah, so glad it worked out for them. I mean, hopefully hopefully this guy doesn't do the same, you know? Hopefully he resists and he's able to pass the test. And yeah. if he doesn't, if he ends up failing, at least you know and you could maybe move on and try to find the next person, you know? <laughs> and, then I'll, and then I'll see you guys again. <laughs> we'll do this all over again. <laughs> That's so sad. But chat, to, uh, to all of you guys that be like, oh, I'm a fucker friend, Chat, if you can fuck her friends, that was an L girl to start with. You know what I'm saying? Any girl I've ever fucked with, for example, Melly, her best friend, would never, ever let me hit. She loyal as fuck, and that says a lot about Melly as well, because that's the person she hangs out with. That's her best friend. I, that's what I'm saying. Like, I don't know. Like, you know how, like, how sad that shit is if there's, if there's, like, a friend group and they're fucking each other mans? It says a lot about each each girl's like each girl's character. That's not somebody you wanna fuck with. Out of anybody in that group, that's not somebody you wanna fuck with at all. A real group of bitches, nobody gonna let you hit, nigga. Nobody. Especially knowing that you're trying to get at her friend. Ooh. This is good. I like that. I, I feel like I can taste that like oat. I told you it's bomb. Protein. It's no, but my nigga can Rachel be seduced way easier than a girl. Small talk and enjoying her smoothie with Jay. Eventually, though, she finally got around to making her move. Okay, I think this is it. I think she's starting to ease her way in there. We've been wanting to go on a run for a while now, for sure. But we just hadn't like gotten the chance to or anything yeah. like that. So. She's been busy with one thing, I've been busy with another thing, so I'm like... I hit a, I hit a run fun, every morning, so... Every yeah, morning? You guys, yeah. Damn, okay. Well, I'm a morning person, so if you ever need a running buddy, just let me know. Okay. Yeah. Here, actually, let me get your number, so that way, we, whenever we need to plan it, we can just plan on doing another run or something. You can hear okay? Yeah. Yeah, yeah we're good. But, you know, I do feel like... I El boyfriend, kind of he took the number. That you had to basically do the entire smoothie process and I, it was an utter fail on my part. I mean, that's fine. I and I wanted to like maybe really go really out to dinner really with you. Go out to dinner with me? Yeah, like. You want a treat? You want to treat me? Yeah, me yeah, we could it. just go out to dinner, like a little dinner date or something. A date? We're going full date time. When are you free next? Like Friday, next week? Probably not the weekend. We have to do week. Probably not the a girl comes up to me. A girl approaches me. No girl spit game at me. No! Don't allow that. See, let me give you a scenario. You probably don't don't get what you mean, what I mean by a, I won't let a girl spit game at me. Okay, let give me let me give you a scenario, right? You're sitting down. You're just waiting for a friend. A girl really finds you attractive, she comes up to you. She'd be like, hey, how you doing? Immediately flip it over. Now you the one asking questions. Don't say good. Don't be like good, nigga. You you not no bitch. You think you gonna be like good? Oh, she gonna ask you what's your name. You gonna tell her your name? How about you? You the bitch. You getting gamed? No, the bitch comes up to me. 
I, you know what I'm saying? You gotta evaluate the bitch first. And then she, she comes up to you, and then she says, what's up to you? You evaluate her, and if she's a baddie and you like her, you get on the attack. Oh, I'm good. How about you? What's your name? She answers the question. Oh, what's your name? Now you're the one asking questions. So now you're the one spitting game. Don't let a bitch spit game on you. You a bitch or something? Weekend. You a bitch or something? I'm hoping he's just trying to be nice here, you know? Can Girl, he not trying to be nice? You dumb. Some other time, yeah. separately. Absolutely. So would you... Hang out? We could be friends. You'd be just friends? Because I was thinking, like, maybe a little bit. A little bit more than friends. A little bit more than friends. To, to be a little bit more candid. Okay. You're really attractive. Let's just be real. Thank you. So, I was just wondering if it is really that serious with Angel, or if you'd be open to going on like a dinner date or uh, something like that. I mean, it's that. pretty serious. You've only been going out for like three months, so like, Th but is it really that months. serious? Three months doesn't. Yeah, I mean, if I met her three months ago, or I met her six months ago, I'd still feel the same way to her. Mm -hmm. Time doesn't mean anything. It's like. Even if even if you've been with somebody for three months, you could still be serious. Right. You've been treating things pretty serious. But sometimes you can be with somebody for three years and it's still in the casual phase too. Right. So okay. again, some people don't want to settle down. Yeah. I mean, what's what's your where are you kind of feeling with that? I mean, I've been looking for something serious. Yeah. That's how I've been going about this. Mm -hmm. and I feel like that's how anyone should be with any decision. You know, if you're, right. if you're in a job, you know, any job you should be fully. Yeah. In a relationship. So like you're like really. Settled in with been, Angel. Yeah, I've been pretty settled in. Yeah. We've yeah. well, we had a lot of good times. I mean, you could have good times with her. You could have good times with me. What would be better? <laughs> She's good. I told you. <laughs> it sounds like you have some sort of something going on in your head. Some scenario. I'm sorry. What's I. What's your ideal scenario on this? I didn't my think. ideal scenario would be you say yes to going on a dinner date with me because you find <laughs> me you. as attractive yeah. as I find yeah. you. We can go get dinner. What's wrong with that? So, so let me just get this clear. If we were to go out to dinner, it wouldn't be a date in your eyes? No, no. Even can't. though it would be in my eyes? We can't. Like what you would tell if, Angel? If, if, if you think about it that way, then we might not be able to do that either. Okay. Some in me tells me to believe in this nigga. You know what? Well, you know what? If this man loses, my dick is small. No, why are you muting it? Not call it a date, but you know what I mean. Same intention. If you're gonna put it like that, I wouldn't feel right about it. Yeah. Come on. Okay. That that's yeah. good. That's good, right? That's how, do you, good. how do you see that? He's he's pretty much like rejected her. She just is still doing her part and like prying at him. I mean, you know what? I respect that. You and Angel. <laughs> If you're super serious about her, like, I can respect that. Like, this is a nice man. I'm not no nice nigga. I'll tell the bitch straight up. Get the fuck out of my face, bitch. I got a girlfriend. If, if that's if that's what you want to do, that's what you're going to do. I'm a loyal I'm man. I'm sorry that, like, if it made anything awkward or anything that's like right. that. Yeah, yeah. It's fine. It's fine. But Look, if you still... If you anti, ever, guess what? My dick going to get a lot like bigger that, after this. Let me know. I'm a morning no, person. No, homo. What the but fuck? Just, I hope clean slate... I, I'm sorry. I don't know where, where the heck she went off to anyway. I know, should I try calling her again? I, f I felt like in the beginning he was kind of like taking us in a little bit right. of like for a ride, right? right? And I didn't know where this was gonna, oh my God. I'm I so think he sorry. passed, he passed it. <laughs> oh, this is just like, he passed it. a lot. Hey, you pass it. For a while. I'll give it a couple minutes, I guess. Hopefully. I he mean, pass if not, it. like, we can always like go to the Come on. Too and I honestly, I do feel like a huge sense of relief right now. I mean, Come on. Okay. I mean, ultimately he did what I wanted him to do. And he like, he yeah. pretty much pushed her to the side. I could see how there may be like a piece of him that was like, oh, well, I mean, we just are yeah. getting started here. But ultimately, I don't know. I consider that a pass. Yeah, and okay. <laughs> Which to Angel meant that he successfully passed this test. Do you want to tell him about any of this? Do you want to go back upstairs and like tell him that you put him to the test? God, no, I don't think I, I, don't think I want to tell him about any of this. You don't this. have to if you don't want to, but you can if you want to, to, to. I think if it would have gone a totally different direction, we could have exposed everything, but for now, 
I think we should keep this on the down low. Cool, <laughs> like, cool. How do you feel about us posting this video onto YouTube? Yeah, you know what? I want I want girls to have faith. I want them to have, see that there are loyal men out there. <laughs> yeah, me, me, so me, me, me. me. This test was Jay Bucks was goody. We sent Angel back upstairs to pretend to like none of this ever happened. Everything just seems so Wait, natural, so fluid. Why is there 12 minutes left of the video? Guys, Rachel's good. She's, She's good. good. Rachel and Angel played everything off and drank their smoothies for another 20 minutes or so before casually deciding to call it a day. For all we knew, this was just another happy ending. However, as I'm sure you all noticed, this video is far from over. Do you have your phone? Oh. Uh, You're good. Okay. <laughs> Bye. Ah, uh, she gonna text him. So a couple days after the test, I received a text message from Rachel saying that Jay had sent her this message. Apparently, he had changed his mind about everything. Hey, Sergio. Hey, hey, hey. So he just sent you that? Like, that was, like, literally, he just sent you that message out of nowhere? Or, or were you guys, the like, talking beforehand or anything? No, no, no. He just sent it to me out of the blue. Like, we haven't been talking since the last time that I saw them. That is crazy. I don't, like... I haven't responded yet because I'm not really no, sure. No, no, my dick is like medium. Yes my dick is a medium. My dick is a medium. He like have anything. passed. I would say let's hold off and let he have passed. touch with Angel and ask her what she wants to do. Okay. And then we can kind of go from there. Maybe text him and kind of like string him along a little bit, but don't fully commit to anything. Yeah, I can give like a loose response to him just so it doesn't seem like I'm ignoring it. Like maybe the day of he was just like, oh, well, like, like she's coming back. So I don't want there to be awkward tension or something. But like, I have not spoken to him since. How long has it been? So Joe, ask her that. That is crazy. Okay, well, let me uh, let me talk to let me talk to Angel and let me see what she wants to do. Okay. Bro, my dick is half medium oh size. This is so ridiculous. I was waiting for him to tell me that that incident even happened, like with him and Rachel, and you know what? He never did. I kind of feel like that should have been my red flag. Like this just goes to show, like he had plans, you know. Yeah, well, I mean, the purpose of my call is to ask you, like, do you want to start the test back up again, or do you want to, like... I mean, is that an option? We could do that. <laughs> oh, if you want to, we can. If you want to, we can. It's up to you. I hate to say it, but it appears oh, that Jay had a so happy. Fruit. You know, in retrospect, his responses to Rachel's offer did seem a little bit too perfect and analytical. It's almost as if he suspected that something was up or he was afraid that Angel would walk back in at any moment. Or who knows, maybe he was just playing hard to get. Hello? How are you? I'm all right. Good. I, I just, I wanted to give you a call. I know, I know we already said everything over text, but I just wanted to really make sure that, like, you're cool with, like, coming over or we can still, you know, plan something. Because, I mean, you know my in intentions with everything and, um... Like, comfortable with it? Of course. Okay, I just, I just wanted to make sure. You seemed, like, very fuck. adamant last time that you were, like, <laughs> no, but, like, well, if, if, if you're cool with you it... Me, you caught me off guard. Okay. Angel elected to keep this test going, so that's exactly what we did. Rachel kept in touch with us and scheduled a movie date with him about a week later. I mean, on the bright side, the items that we got from Hive came in, so <laughs> at least we can give Angel what we got for her. I mean, I'm right in her a week a bit. Get the give. fuck out of here with this hype shit, boy. Hello. Hey, babe. What's going on? What are you doing? Just hanging out at the house. Mm. What about you? Nothing. I was just wondering if you wanted to do something later on. Um, later around what time? Um, I don't know, just like in a couple hours. I kind of figured that out, to be honest. Um, I was talking to Luca. He wants to eat. I guess he, he might be doing a show, and I was going to go support him. Oh, okay. Well, that's fine. I just wanted to see what you were up to. I mean, I'll let you know about later. Right now, that's, that's, that's kind of my plan, you know. Bitch, you lied to me, talking about you never break my heart. Bitch, you lied to me, talking about you... Tonight and uh, I can keep you posted. Oh yeah, my god, what happened to Angel? Alright, sounds good. Okay. Right, bye. Bye. Damn, he gonna say I love you? Oh, damn. And he gonna go fuck with another girl? I just. It makes me feel like such an idiot. Oh, but I mean, I'm, I'm glad I'm like figuring this out about him now. Don't cry! Later. So at this point, we were very confident that Jay was gonna come over and enjoy a movie date with Rachel. All that was pretty much Rachel, left to bro, do was just ugly wait fun. for him to arrive. What was that? I, I really hate this, but there's, there's like, there's literally nothing he can do to like recover from this. We're done. 
Hello? Uh, you're done. Oh, I think this is it. This is uh, him. you're oh, done. Just up. Okay, cool. I will meet you downstairs and then I'll walk you back up. Sounds good. Cool, all right, see you see soon. Up. Okay, bye. Oh man, this is it. He's here, he showed up. I don't even want to see his face. Oh man, this is not good. <laughs> this is all I need. Uh, yeah, so I brought these. I don't know if you've ever tried them. Uh, what are they? So did you want to go in there and talk to him, confront him? Yeah, uh, yeah, I did. Melly, don't you feel bad If you want to walk in there right now, we can walk in there right now, but I'm going to be honest. I feel like if you walk in there right now, I feel like he's going to be like, I'm just here to watch a movie with her. Like, I'm not doing anything else. Watch Mysterious People Iceberg Explained video after this. What you think? This is a classroom? We ain't trying to learn and shit. We ain't trying to watch an educational video and shit. Maybe we should have let them choose out a movie to watch. What the fuck? And then fuck? see if his behavior changes. Jin, what's stuff. up with you? But again, it's completely Relax. Up to you. I know he's already here. I know he already agreed to come and whatnot, but you know, I'm just saying, like, he might be denying it. Alright, I'll. I'll kind of wait a second. After making the popcorn and serving the wine, Rachel brings Jay to the living room to pick out a movie to watch. To me, Jay's intentions are perfectly clear. He's here behind his girlfriend's back and ready to have a good night with Rachel. However, we didn't want to leave him any room for excuses, so we thought it best to keep this thing going a little bit more to see if anything else would happen. Does Angel know you're here, or...? <laughs> Why are we talking about Angel right now? I don't know, I just like, I... You're the one who wanted to hang out. I'm, I'm just covering like my bases in case she like texts me or something like that. I just don't wanna... <laughs> I'm just trying to cover my bases, that's if all. If you're asking me about Angel, I feel like, I don't know. What? I feel like if he's getting that uncomfortable at the mention of your name, I feel like he knows like, yo, I should have not be here. Little does he know that I'm watching everything. Why are you so, why are you acting so awkward? You're about Angel, dude. Like, okay, if I, I, I swear I would, okay, I... Bad, bad call on my part. Rachel bringing up Angel seemed to have spooked Jay, but he didn't get up and leave. So Rachel dropped the subject and proceeded at choosing out a movie for them to watch. All right, thank I'm you. Absolutely demolishing the book. No, it's okay. There's like two more bags, so if you want, to, if you want me to make more, I can make more. Ready to go. After some time, Jay began dropping his guard and getting comfortable again, finally giving Angel a clear visual of his intentions. Yo. I think that was the clarification I, I needed. Bro, you Levi is so dramatic. Imagine you're going through this, watching your significant other cheat, and he's in your ear. Oh. Oh, that's tough. No. Oh, that's crazy. I'll slap that motherfucker out of the motherfucking are perfectly clear you know you don't yeah. do that to a friend or if you're just there to hang yeah. out you get what i mean like yeah. imagine this was not a test what would happen after the movie what would happen during the movie yeah i'm ready to go in there and ask him what the fuck he's doing here what do you think he's gonna say he's gonna deny it and play dumb i'm sure if this was just friends hanging out first of all i would be here second of all i would know about it third who's men mad, mad at this time man. third the fucking arm wow w <laughs> i can't wait to hear the bs he's gonna give me when i get in there and so after a crazy long test filled with a roller coaster of emotions, oh, Angel look, decides was to so happy. And so after a crazy long test filled with a roller Look, she thought he died. She, she thought he passed. He thought he But you know, bro, it's kinda unfair, bro. Like, you know what UDY should do? UDY should keep she test. Niggas with, with with bitches with the same leak as they girls. You know what I'm saying? Uh, the coaster of emotions, Angel decides to finally confront Jay. There is no telling how Jay is going to react. Like, like if I wanted my girl to be tested, you know, I wouldn't tell him, go test her with Michael B. Jordan. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't go test her, go test him with these pretty ass motherfuckers, me pretty ass niggas. I think I'm just at a little bit of a disadvantage. It's a joke. They shouldn't cheat regardless. Jesus Christ, it's a joke, bro. But I hope you guys have joke, your talkies bro. because you guys huh? already know. This, this shit's gonna, gonna be good. Man, y'all missed that one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I missed that one. What the hell? Really? Are you kidding? This is where you had to be today? <laughs> this is out with the boys? <laughs> This is that really important show you had to go see. Whoa, 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 what were they watching? Office that lame ass show! How you go to a bitch's house 
And bro, how you go to a bitch's house and you open a fucking office? Nigga, put on some fucking Titanic or something. Put on some Fifty Shades of Grey or something. So you could whip it out with the movie. You gotta think. Why are you watching a funny movie? Why are you watching a funny movie? Go watch something sexy or something and then you can whip it out with the movie. Make the bitch feel like you making a movie. This is that really important show you had to go see? Yeah, what's, get on our ass. What's all this? How about, how about you start off with explaining what the fuck it is you're Yeah, doing? how about this? You got clipped, boy. That? Yo, you didn't want to go come and explain why. You didn't want to explain ass. Okay. Yeah, okay. Okay, so then how about you explain why you're here? We were just hanging out. And how's that going? It was going pretty good until this happened. Okay, so well. So apparently you don't trust me, which is obvious. Yeah, it's, 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 so this nope. entire thing basically is <laughs> So, um. So this entire thing was a test. Up. Uh, so from the start, it was recorded, and this was the whole test. Rachel don't like you. She wasn't gonna fuck with you in the first place. So you got tested, and you just fit. <laughs> you wise ugly hey, ass, bro. Yeah, it's, 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 so, so this so, entire thing basically is all a test. Yeah. Like Angel wanted to find out if you would stay loyal to her or go on a date with Rachel. And so we set this entire thing oh up, like none of this was real. This was all part of the plan to see if you were loyal to Angel or not. And I mean, and we rightfully so. W W. Rightfully we so, because here for, we are. Here we are. Bitch, get on his for ass. What do you mean for what? Here we are. Mm -hmm. I mean, she had her reasons to test you. You know, no, no. where, not where, today. where else would this have gone had I not walked in two seconds ago? Nowhere. God knows what else was gonna happen. Nothing. Nothing. Nothing, was nothing else was gonna happen. I was entertaining the idea of it. Yeah, it's not, it's not a big deal if you- He's a dickhead! Tat! The bitch can't, not even really tatting. She not really tatting her shit. She should have been like, you ain't shit, motherfucker. You should be quiet. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Right? And if she was smart, she will inspect the surrounding, right? There is niggas around. So he's never gonna get to attack her. So I say, you get mad, act like you're getting close to him, yelling at him. One punch. And then let him be weak. At least your anger is going to come out. One punch, you got to shock the motherfucker. He's going to try to get up and uh, attack you. You D.Y. going to attack with that motherfucker. See, but you bitch is not smart, though. Nah, she's, she's talking nonsense. She's chatting nonsense. Nobody knows who she's talking. He, bro, if nobody was here, he would have probably convinced her that this wasn't going going anywhere. And then she would have got probably got back with him. Just like... If you're hanging out with somebody, you go over to the house. I I tried to tell her multiple times. I said, we're not, we're just friends. I did say that multiple times. I told you that. Oh, so this is all your fault. Right? No, why are you discarding the fact that he lied to you to come here? Keep bringing that up. Don't, don't let him slip with this, bro. Right? This is all her fault. This is all my fault. You're you're the victim Listen, here. In the beginning, I wanted to be friends. You this know, is this is a, a you bit. are the reason that we are literally if here. If you don't right have now. any trust in a relationship, the relationship's already over. You want to bring up trust now? Get the fuck out of here, Jordan. I mean, really? Like if Please. The Why do you think they're all here they were, for this exact months, reason? Because there was a camera team. Absolutely. To your friend's house. Oh, okay. She's yeah. a nice girl. She offered to have me over. I'm so sorry. Are we all on the same page? Like, are we in the She's same room right now? You do girl. not get to be the victim She's here. the perfect girl for me. But is that fair to her to He been in the game for so long. <laughs> he playing a good game right here. See, me as a man, I, I give I give credit where credit is due. He's playing a great game right here. He's about to get away with this. Say that she needs to trust you if clearly you're not well, to be trusted. I don't I don't think like you're getting it. Like we're all do anything. How respect I mean, we're up, that's about it. Just get the fuck out. We're done. Go? Yes, obviously this is done. Like you want me to go? please. I was doing my own test. We need come with that. What what the fuck? <laughs> He's on a whole nother level! <laughs> what kind of dumb ass motherfucker? I was doing my own test? Are you serious? <laughs> oh my god, what happened to Virgil? Tat, bro, Tat, look. He would dead ass sit down and tell her. I knew this was this whole thing was happening. I saw the cameras. I would just wanted to see if you would trust me or not. I guess you didn't trust me. It's your fault we're breaking up and walk out. 
If you walk out right there, she gonna call you. He said I'm doing my own tent. The nigga been in the game for so long, but did been not picking up on that though. Like, how are you this good at giving excuses? Have you done this before? Like, the bitch dumb. An experience. We're just having. We're just having a good night. Yeah, and if I didn't end this test two seconds ago, then where would that experiment have? Liu Ha. Liu Ha. What's goody? I don't wait, like wait, 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 Where would that experiment have taken you? Wait, good night. Yeah, and if I didn't alone. end this test, wait, wait, wait. what the fuck would you test? An experience. We're just wait. doing my own test. Okay, we doing didn't... your own test. <laughs> what, what the fuck would you test? An experience. We're just, having, we're just having a good night. Yeah, and if I didn't end this test two seconds ago, then where would that experiment have taken you? And I, yeah, I don't think it's going to work out. <laughs> I don't, I can't be with somebody who's insecure. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm, uh, I'm sorry. Are you breaking? See that hits though. That hits though. If you get caught, you you say some bitch, some shit like that. That hits bitches though. The, on some like, I, I if you're if you're like if you're like insecure, I can't be with you even moving forward. I was doing this whole thing to prove that you're insecure. That's all I needed to leave. I'm done. Picking up with me? Yeah, absolutely. I'm good. <laughs> really? Because we've right, been guys. done since the moment I walked yeah. through that door. Yeah. Fuck out. <laughs> Alright guys, bye bye. Are you kidding me? Fucking oh. asshole. Don't cry! Why you might don't tease me? So any regrets with car. doing this? Besides maybe putting myself on blast? Uh, no. No, I don't think so. <laughs> well, the reason we gathered you here today a week been later is on because before we actually have a surprise for you from our friends at Hyde. <laughs> you wanna go? <laughs> Bitch, you gonna cry about this <laughs> motherfucker cheating on you, and you know he cry, and you gonna cry over a gift, over some clothes. Bitch, is you broke? <laughs> There's a lot of cool stuff there. Yo. <laughs> wait, Bitch. I'm actually wait. Bitch, I'm, are you wait, broke? Huh. I'm hitting that hole.